This is Ryan Greenberg and you're watching BoxingTribune.com. Zero losses with 17 wins by knockout. He's currently from Haifa, Israel, Roman Greenberg. Thanks everybody. It's, uh, first of all, it's a big pleasure to be here in uh, New York. Um, I'm quite amazed what's going on, which uh, is very interesting. My uh, beautiful Fernand, the place for boxing. Um, I want to thank the Warriors, the Seminole Tribe, the Warrior staff, my uh, trainers, Jim, Steve. Yeah, for getting me here. Um, I'll, I'll do my best. I hope you like the fight. And uh, I want to wish all the fighters on the show good luck. On Saturday, I can make a year. Except for the one you fight. What's your plan? What's your plan? No one can say better than Bernardo. And uh, it's all done. Next time we'll be our champion. Thank you. is joined with Roman Greenberg, who's fighting this Saturday, March 10th. Roman, can you tell the fans a little bit about yourself? Well, I um, started my professional career when I was um, 19, I think. Yeah, 19. Um, 2001. Uh, since then, I had 24 fights, 24 wins, um, 17 wins by way of knockout. And um, hopefully this year we, I want to try and have a world title fight. Now, um, how's your training going for this fight? Can you uh, tell us a little bit about that? Uh, training's been going well. Obviously not much of a training left now. Just final sort of little preparations. Um, I mean, we've, I've been training hard with my uh, you know team around me. We've, I've been doing my work, so, you know, that shouldn't be a problem. Obviously, um, I still need to look at uh, my fighters' um, tapes and how he fights and to work out some sort of strategy against him. Um, but I think that won't be a problem as well. So hopefully, you know, um, I'll come up with my hands up. So you have not seen any tape whatsoever? Not yet. I will be. I will be today tomorrow. So we still, we, we already have tapes. It's just about, you know, a matter of looking at them. What is uh, your most powerful punch? Um, it, uh, it's hard to tell because uh, I um, I did knock out I did knock out people with a straight right hand and with like right uppercut and um, some of the hooks were quite you know um, dangerous. So it's hard to tell really. It's uh, a lot about the timing of the punch and. Uh, about the impact of you know the body and the power so but I I'm training really hard and I'm trying to achieve that you know any punch of mine is going to be devastating uh, what does this fight mean to you being here in New York and in Madison Square Garden uh, that's a big honor you know uh, great thing for me that's the uh, first time in my career I fight in um, such a such a venue, Madison Square Garden is the place for boxing. You know, or you know, the greatest fight, one of the greatest, many of the greatest fights happen in Madison Square Garden. So, you know, um, I hope my this one won't be my last one. You know, I hope to impress everybody. You know, give a good performance and again win the fight. But it's great to be here. Do you have any prediction about your fight? No, I don't like to predict fights. You know, don't. I don't want to put myself under any sort of pressure. And um, if it doesn't go my way, you know, people, you know, I don't want to sort of predicting wrongly. So, I, I, I like to, you know, get into the fight first, second round, see what he's got, and then, and then try and get it over with. You know. Would you like to say anything to you, all your fans or all the fans that are going to see you fight uh, March 10th? Oh, I'd like to just, you know, to thank everybody who um, who supports me uh, around the world and especially in Israel because, you know, 
Um, I've been getting a lot of um, support and attention lately from fans from Israel, which is great. Thank you.